it's the crypto lightsaber back with another video guys so we want to talk about aims DeFi. okay now this team are responsible for alto and of course aims DeFi. right they've also got a cavern call which we're going to talk about which is in addition to aims sort of like the detonator if you're familiar with the detonator from emp money right and then also the equinox dex which is a decentralized exchange these guys are building out a whole ecosystem and for me they're probably one of the most bullish yet underrated teams in the whole of DeFi. when you think about great finance for example they've got a pretty good reputation of keeping their tomb fork at price of their you know um their, their native token right the grape token on peg aims a quickly getting that type of reputation too right aims is on peg it was below peg for a little bit now it's back over peg or it was well it's still over peg right and it was over peg but about one dollar and four cents just a few minutes ago okay we're going to talk about um how this works if you're not familiar with it right normally with tomb forks you have uh you know the initial token you need then you have the share token and you have the bonds so if you're familiar with tomb forks you know how that works already okay uh, but with this particular project, they've got so many things that are working together to support the whole ecosystem that there's no reason to not be bullish on this in the long run. So um, let's break down how you can profit from this particular project, take advantage of stablecoin yields in the bear market, right? So if we just go to the farms, right? So first off the back, you can see we have the vaults, okay, guys, uh, or this single staking vault for the AIMS token, all right? Um, I prefer to use the farms, okay, but um, it's hundred and ninety six percent. The vaults are normally auto compounding, all right. But uh, with BUSD and LP, it's going to keep it a little bit more stable for you, okay, because the BUSD is sometimes aims obviously goes off peg, but um, the aim is for aims to remain on peg, okay, guys, and that way you don't really suffer from impermanent loss. So I always recommend buying something like the aims token when it is off peg, okay. So if you see it go off peg probably a good time to buy because you know ultimately if the team keep delivering like they have been delivering right it's going to be back on peg and the, you're not going to suffer any impermanent loss especially being paired up with busd right so you can earn up to 259 percent which is obviously fluctuating uh, dependent on the amount of money that's in there but right now it's 259 260 percent just under and you can stake your lp in here so this is the pool that i'm looking to take advantage of okay guys a lot of times i'm in and out of these things you know because uh you know sometimes you just need to free up capital to do other stuff but i'm um, definitely looking to take advantage of the aims busd pools there are other pools of course if we just scroll down you have the a share busd pool and the aims a share pool is actually not running by the looks of it no that's not running okay so we have the a share busd lp pool now a share of course is going to be your more volatile token because the share token all right it's the token that people are kind of cashing out their profits on okay the aim is to farm right to farm or stake or whatever you can earn your a share right and then when you earn your a share you're going to take profits from you know you're going to take your rewards your dividends from the a share token rather than you know aims right because you can stake in the boardroom you can stake a share in the boardroom and earn aims but you don't really want to be selling your aims you want to be selling your a share that's where you want to draw your profits from uh, because you know you want this to continue to print for you long term right and then um, you know if it stays on peg it's going to print for you you know much longer than you know if you just take a little short-term gain and you can basically milk this thing for you know profit upon profit yield upon yield if you use the system correctly all right guys farm some a share all right take your a share over to the boardroom dash it in the boardroom earn aims and then pair up your aims all over again or put it in the vault and earn more a share so that's the best way to use these things right um i know they had nodes um i don't not sure if the nodes are still running but the a share nodes and um, they they sell limited nodes all right guys um so you can actually you know take your aims or a share out of circulation get the node and get like a yearly apr on that as well so you might want to take advantage of that take advantage of uh, advantage of the boardroom but the boardroom only pays out when aims is on peg okay guys so um it's a little bit more risky especially because the fact you're in a share right and a share is more volatile and then if aims is not on peg it's not going to pay you out any aims as well so you know most people prefer to take advantage of the farms 
But like I said, when you earn from the farms, you can take the A share and put it in the boardroom. And really, it's just playing with house money. All right, guys. So if you look at the TVL, it's about 1.7 million at the moment. Almost 1.8 million TVL. And um, I expect this to grow. The team have always delivered. Uh, they're coming up with all sorts of stuff. Let's go back to the cavern crawl. Okay, so the cavern crawl is going to be their answer to the detonator. It's not competition or anything like that. But um, it's an ecosystem, right? So you got to innovate, right? If you see things that are doing well out there as well, you got to come up with a solution as well. You know, kind of, you know, play your hand and, um, you know, just improve your system altogether. If something works and uh, there's nothing wrong with kind of like, you know, taking advantage of that as well okay guys so uh with the cavern crawl it's not launched yet all right but this is just a sneak peek of what the uh, what the cavern crawl is going to be and um, if you're familiar with the detonator like i said you already know how this is going to work i believe that this is paired up with uh, this is going to be um because obviously in the detonator you go in with lp tokens right so um um I'm, yeah this is going to be with busd and aims i believe right so you pair up your aims and your busd i would like to see a b and b pool okay just like um detonator is paired up with um the, the emp is paired up with uh, ethereum okay so it's good to have exposure to that volatility or you know or well you know b and b you know it's, it's quite stable obviously being a top tier old coin a blue chip um but you know the volatility is still there with the obviously price movements yeah with the market but um, being paired up with BUSD is safe, but I still like that little bit of volatility of exposure to a blue chip altcoin because it just gives you a way to accumulate, um, you know, your blue chip, right? Um, that being said, obviously, you guys know that, um, you know, I'm a big supporter of the Auto project. I'm a long term investor in this as well. So um, you can go back and watch my various videos on this particular project okay guys but i believe bitcoin has now been added to the bank um i'm also getting yields from here right so yeah bitcoin has now been added to the deep blue bank so you're actually earning bitcoin and ethereum as well by using auto okay if you don't know what the deep blue bank is right you basically got these um time locked deposits right so a certificate of deposit and then what you do is you can lock it in here for let's say for example and um, this is a seven day lock right 14 day 30 day 60 day 90 day 180 day which is six months all the way up to a year 365 days and you can basically earn um dividends right dividends for locking up your your auto tokens in the bank and that's also going to give you rebases because Auto is a rebase token, which has uh, it's been performing pretty well. All right, guys, 2K in. I put 1K into this pool, 1K into that pool, and I'm still up like 4X, right? Three, three or 4X almost. And um, that's after the price has had a huge dip, right? So that's not even all-time high. Okay, guys, so definitely happy with that and um yeah now i'm earning btcb which is obviously the binance smart chain version of bitcoin so that is super bullish let's just add that to the metamask okay guys so alto aims pretty bullish team right another thing that they've got coming is the equinox dex all right guys this is a whole nother video in itself they're gonna have a new token called the aeq token which you can actually buy in the seed sale if you contact me it is a 10k minimum okay guys so i can put you in touch with the team they're not having a pre-sale they're not having a private sale they're not having anything like that it's literally just going to be a seed sale okay guys which is why it's a 10k minimum all right you can put more if you want but, um, you know, I've definitely got access to the developers to kind of make that happen if you'd like to participate in the seed round for this particular project. Um, I'll leave the link to this in the description so you can read through it, right? But um, in this video, we're not going to go through the whole thing. But I'm going to be covering this on video because I'm a huge supporter of this platform. Anyway, I'm a huge supporter of Alto and Ames. Right, guys, and the Equinox decks. Um, I trust the team. A lot of times, I'm betting on the team. I'm betting on the developers, right? So when it comes to something like this, we've seen a lot of rebase tokens, for example, right? A lot of them I've kind of sold and taken profit. A lot of them I won't, like, leave my money in there long term because a lot of them dump, right? 
But um, with Alto, I, I was always confident that these guys were a good team. And they've got a long-standing reputation. I mean, Ames has been around for quite a long time now. Couldn't put a, a number on it, but, you know, I'm sure it's like, you know, the best part of a year. So I know these guys are not a rug pool. They're not one of those projects that's just going to go and like, you know, um, what's it? I've seen one recently. Um, I've seen a few recently, actually, uh, kind of sell, um, get acquired by a different team. We saw Titan get acquired by um, Liquid Capital. We've seen uh, Lucky Sevens get acquired by D Firm. Um, these people just, it's like they don't consider uh, a bridge before they cross it, right? And um, Alto are not one of them teams. Like I said, they're one of the most underrated or bullish, but yet underrated teams in DeFi, in my opinion. And that's just my opinion. You might disagree. But, um, I mean, the numbers don't lie, right? I've seen nothing but profit and gains out of this ecosystem, out of this team. Okay, guys, so Equinox Dex, I don't expect any different. I think these guys can pull it off. I think it's going to happen. All right, guys, so if you want to get in on the seed sale for the Equinox Dex, let me know. All right, guys, come and join us in the Crypto Insomniacs, right? Um, you can access me right here. And um, this is where we're calling out various different projects, okay? Not everything that I talk about gets to video, right? Just so I don't forget, I'm also doing my first, my very first AMA today at 4 p.m. UTC, okay? My very first AMA um, with the Bandit Project, okay, guys? So if you have time, come and join us in the AMA. We're also doing a giveaway. Like I said, we're doing a giveaway um, for a whitelist. Uh, for hexgo.com let's just show you what that looks like uh, we're going to be doing a giveaway for this particular project and not only that um give away some bandit tokens all right guys so you can see the hexgo um vault card right here um come and join us in the ama yeah 4 p.m utc with the bandit project bullish project nft project roi and so on okay they've got a public sale coming up so you know it will be my first ama like i said um come and support the channel um and let's do it all right guys so that being said um i'll leave all the links in the description do me a favor and subscribe to the channel tick the little bell for notifications like the video which helps with the youtube algorithm and i'll see you at 4 p.m utc in the crypto insomniacs telegram group link is in the description